Hello everybody and welcome back to A Clash of Kings 2.1, the Mountain Blade Warband mod. We have uh, found a little town with bandits in it. Uh, Forty of them. Hold. Hold. Um, they're infesting this town apparently. I'm not sure where they are, but this doesn't seem like a horrible place to hold. Uh, let's move right in here in this open. Oh, there are, you cut through these like butter. Oh yeah. Although I probably shouldn't let my horse get this hurt. Quit hitting my horse. Oh shit, charge, I'm about to get knocked out. Okay, you can cut through them like butter, but they still hurt. Uh, okay, armed villager, I was like... Excuse me? My men do not get knocked out that easily. Supposed to be 40 of them? I guess it's 40. Uh, armed villager knocked out. Armed villager. Armed villager killed. Man, there's a freaking crap load of villagers fighting with me, huh? Damn. Guys, just let the Hedge Knights and, like, Martin Snow in the front. Hedge Knight killed by Forest Bandit? What? That's ridiculous. This is ludicrous. Hedge Knight knocked unconscious, Martin Snow knocked unconscious. Hedge Knight knocked out. Can we... Hedge... Uh, Forest Bandit killed... Is that not almost all of them yet? I mean... Oh, wrong way. Are there really... I thought I told them all to charge. Why... Why is it like a few people fighting all these? Well, we're gonna pull back because... I mean, we already lost a Hedge Knight and a freaking Caravan Master. Damn it. And then we'll continue. You cannot defeat the bandits. They... Oh... Man, that's just sad. Okay, well that town like burned. Yeah, it's looted now by bandits. Why am I in a boat? Uh, yeah, I don't need ale. Apparently you can't use ale. I was just sitting here waiting for the next paycheck, really. Like, just, just sit here. And, uh, so I have a plan to try to make our own our own empire a uh, thousand coins gifts on the local orphans I don't have the money so I'll spend an hour in prayer the sept is cold and my knees hurt probably <laughs> yeah okay we made 3700 in the bank because we have balance is now 77,000 that's pretty good what do we make off of our enterprises 4,000 that's not bad that's not bad at all. Okay. The so only problem would be that that would be like negative 600 without the mercenary payment. So, I don't know, man. We got to figure something out. Because it's just freaking ridiculous. Okay. Uh, is there anyone? No, I don't want to go to the castle. Is there anyone in the tavern? Any good... These are two hireable people that can't die. Manfred the Bard, do you know any songs that I don't? Yeah, teach me. Why not? I mean, you gotta you gotta prepare to woo the ladies, man. Okay, so that was that. Back to the tavern. Is there anyone to hire? Dick the Traveler. Uh oh, yes, yes, yes. I am looking for. Ah, uh, never mind. I thought he could tell me where... Gorbo? Weird. I thought he could tell me where... Uh, crap, what am I thinking of? Wow, what am I thinking of? The person that sells Unsullied. I've never heard of the Unsullied before, but perhaps you can enlighten me. I welcome, welcome you into my service. Sure. So teach you all about the Unsullied, the best soldiers in the world, the legacy 
of the lock lockstep legions of Gis. Well, uh, remember, however, that I am one of the ancient and honorable House Patton, and I expect to be treated as such. I don't want to be seen as equals up to those filthy soldiers one often finds in these lands. Wow. Wow. You jerk. Freaking get out. I don't care. Okay, um. There's nothing really there. Okay, so I've realized that. Let's check out Lorath. I want to see how strong their armies are. We don't have much food. Um. We can make it to Lorath in time. I bet. We're still in a freaking boat. Okay, we need to make it to the town of the city of Lorath first, though, or we're not going to do well. People will start to leave my troop if we don't get food before they eat. <laughs> Is that marketplace? Okay, I can't read through all the freaking letters. All that stuff. Cheese doesn't ruin. Okay, that's good. Lorath, how many men are in this? 300. 300. What are they, though? Elite Sellsword Man at Arms. Uh, 66. 100 120 archers. Uh, 180 archers. 200. 220. It's like 230 archers in there. Whew. I'm not sure about that. Um, maybe... Maybe if we had a troop of 200, we could take them out. Which would actually happen after we, uh... <gasps> My plan is that after we can actually afford our troop, or at least close to afford our troop, then we're going to go sit over here like a hawk and wait for the Westerlands to take something. And then, uh, as soon as they take it, there shouldn't be many people there, so, like... I think those people are fine with me. So maybe like the crossing or something, something like near the edge of their influence, we take it over and then that will create our own kingdom. Well, actually, we would have to leave uh, leave the Stormland service first to make sure that it, we don't claim it for them. Make our own kingdom and then we abandon it because like, I mean, like look how freaking huge they still are. There's no way. We abandon it. And then go and either try to take the Three Sisters or Lorath. But honestly, Lorath looks easier. Although they do have some huge, huge armies. Man, I'm not sure about any of these guys. Those are some big armies. Damn. Uh, well, there's not a whole lot of other options, is there? I mean, if I can take... If I could take Lorath without any of the guys getting to me, then maybe I could hold it? Maybe. And the plan is essentially, after I capture and get the extra hundred troops, just get a shitload of archers so that when I do capture somewhere, maybe I can hold it because we'll have enough arrows. At least that's the hope. Um, I mean, like I could try to take something from Core. But I'm pretty sure they have some pretty big armies as well. Rails and Pintos are out of the questions. Uh, Voltanus is out of the question. Uh, Murr is out of the question. I don't think Liss would work. Tyrosh. Hmm. Maybe, but they're surrounded. So, probably not. I feel like the uh, Dorn is probably going to have a lot of people defending it. Um, I mean, honestly, it's it's between Three Sisters and uh, Lorath at this point. Maybe the Free Folk. Um, I don't know. I haven't fought any of the Free Folk. Pretty sure when they invaded, they came with a lot. So, maybe not. Maybe not. Where have I not set up... Enterprise, enterprises yet. I'm pretty sure I've gotten like everywhere. Except for like maybe Lordsport. Man, my nose. My nose itches so bad. Okay. I don't know if I have fair market or not. Um, no, 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 no. Stop. Stop. Uh, reports. Personal character. 
honor rating 77 or now in 479 who's my enemy I have like no enemies pretty much quite a few allies or friends or whatever uh, personal budget what is making real shit pay Tumbleton Tumbleton, Core, and Draconis need to go. Uh, Core, yo. You need to fix your stuff, man. Tumbleton's on the other continent. Let's get down there. Five days of food, we'll be fine. The foraging actually covers a lot of our food intake, I think. I'm pretty sure. Okay, Core, your business, your business model's doing real shitty. I'm sorry, but, um, yes, we want to renew our contract. We will split off some other month. <laughs> Visit your mill. I'm sorry, man, but this is not working. Uh, yeah, 1,200 return is not bad. Um, productive enterprise, ironworks, uh, no oil definitely not wine it's not as bad as the other oh I can't afford it brewery 100 a mil it's like nothing oh, man do we really have to go with a brewery that's shitty it's actually the best though I think sadly it's not even actually a 5% return which is really sad Hey, can you make that sword with two daggers? Ah, uh, he needs two more to do the freaking blood magic voodoo. Okay. Oh well. Let's we'll see if they have food. They do. Good. Good. Oh, we need to sell our crap. All this crap. There we go. Ooh, that's a nice paycheck. Very nice. Core Draconis. Let's get down there. And then across the ocean at Tumbleton. I believe was the last place. Hopefully we'll get another pay by then and we can actually afford a decent thing there. Hopefully. Uh, there we go. Okay. Ah, oh, it's an oil press even. Dude, what are you doing? How are you not making money with an oil press? Um, let's go over the accounts. Uh Wow, fifty eight profit. Nope. Thirty six hundred in return. That's no stop. That's good enough to uh Good enough to buy something else. Okay, so oil sucks. Yeah. Iron. Nope. Wine. Uh, um. Less than five percent tannery. Can't afford though. It's not bad. Breweries. Pretty good. Mill. Real shitty. Weavery maybe. In the negative. Other weavery. Not good. Okay, I guess freaking brewery it is. It's better than a better than the damn oil press. That is depressing. Depressing. Ha. <laughs> okay, Tumbleton, I thought I just fixed you, man. Did I just teleport? Gosh, dang it. I thought I turned that crap off. It's an oil press. Why is <sighs> Do I have too many oil presses? Is this why I... Thirty six hundred. Is that why the price of oil is driven so low? Is because I have a lot of oil pressing businesses. Iron's not that good. Wine, nope. Tannery, nope. Weaveries maybe. No, other weavery. Holy crap, man! That's actually amazing. Um, yeah, that's that's over a ten percent payback. Um, we're gonna wait and get a Weavery and Dye Works. It's 
10,000. Will we be able to get that next? Yeah, okay. So we're going to wait here till paycheck. It shouldn't be too long. Hopefully. Uh, paycheck? Should be fairly soon. Garrett Longley leveled up. Quest cancelled. Ah, whatever. He can get over it. Hugh Grandison. Oh, I got almost 4,000 in the bank. We're getting there. Okay. How much do we get? 4,300. That'll work. Tumbleton. Guildmaster. Sir, I would like a Weavery and Dye Works. 1,500. Hell yes. That is going to be amazing. I mean, when it kicks in, of course. How much time is left? Should I be... Should I go hunting? Um, I kind of want the Westerland Stone King's Landing again so I can do that one quest, but then again, they're kind of a pain in the butt, you know? Okay, let's look over more reports. Weekly budget. What is not paying well? Sisterton. White Harbor. Uh, Voltanus, Norvos. Everything else is doing okay. I mean, I would like, like, Weeping Town to be more. I bet Weeping Town is a, uh... I bet you it's a brewery? It's probably a brewery. Ah, shit, we need food. Stop in Kellington. Uh... Food? Beef. Sweet. I'll take it. Does the weeping eat the berries? Five one-handed. That's good. Okay, yeah, they actually do have a market. I couldn't remember if they had a market or not. Um, I don't want beef, honestly. Yeah, we just take a lot of stuff that doesn't ruin. <laughs> that's, that's the idea. <laughs> Rotted chicken. Here, have all my my useless shit. It's an ironworks that's this bad? Dude, really? Let's go over the accounts. You made 192 last week. Um, how much is an ironworks to open? It's 6,000, isn't it? Uh, you can give me 32 back. How much do I have on me? I don't think I have enough to open anything good. I could have swore it was less than that. Weeping Town, 192. That's still not that good. Ironworks. Shouldn't it be more than that? Okay, really though, Sunspear is much worse. 110? Yo, Sunspear, what are you doing? I just need to spend a little while managing accounts. Holy crap. Yeah, I need to keep an eye on, like, which one of my businesses is doing super shitty. Yeah, I need to close this brewery. I'm so sorry, Master Brewer, but, uh, you're gonna have to move somewhere else. <laughs> I mean, you're doing, you're doing decently for well for a brewery, but sorry. Do I even have enough money to open a place? Okay, well, uh, Guildmaster, let's see what we should get. Uh, weavery, nope. Second weavery, nope. Super expensive thing, definitely not. Ironworks is what we just had. It's real shitty. All right, no, we had a brewery. Oil, real bad. Wine, even worse. Tannery, pretty horrible. A brewery, pretty shitty. Man, this place is just a complete, like, shithole, huh? Damn. That's the only thing that can pay itself off? Oh my gosh, man, this is bad. I'm gonna just put a mill here. Holy crap. You don't even deserve a brewery. That's so horrible. Let's go over to this. I think I have an inter I think I made an enterprise here last time. I'm fairly certain I did. Uh yeah, a brewery. What are you making though? Like what is your income, sir? How much of my money are you taking? I feel like that's where my money might go. 
better give me my money. Um, make a profit of 210. That's actually not bad. Never mind. You're good. I don't need to extort you. Uh, man, there's 550 in this. Definitely not taking this place over. Holy crap. Um, I know I did Tyrosh. Have I done places like Duskendale? I don't think so. Or Maidenpool. I haven't done King's Landing either, have I? Hmm. Oh, come on. Uh, the gods are with us. The crew look relieved. I think that's the best thing to say, like, all the time in those. Because, uh, the crew is always relieved when you say the gods are with us. Like, regardless of whether it seems like they are or not. Okay, let's go to King's Landing. Okay, good. No, no reds. Good, good, good. Oh, there's a melee going on. Yes! Bet on myself. Oh, man, what is the luck? And two on two to start it out. That is the best. Dude, watch out. You should watch out. Oh, how'd I miss that? Will you move? Oh, headshot. That was a nice one. 102 damage. Uh, another two on two. Okay. Follow me. Whoa, there's another archer. You wanna stop, mate? Yo, archer. You wanna stop? Okay, got that. How did he dodge that? Really? Ooh, he's like running around me now. Dude, chill out. Ah. Uh. So if you're backing up and you swing, you don't do like any damage? That's kind of weird. Uh, two teams of three. Follow me. Stop running out into the middle, you idiots. Oh, come on. I can at least take one out, right? No. Okay, got that one. Oh, shot my own guy. Got that one. Okay, good. Man, these iron arrows are just like... They're crazy. Two teams of three. This is a really easy melee. There's no, like, huge team things. Dude, you should move. Oh, come on. Come on. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. Ow. I'm trying to block with my bow. Oh, come on. There we go. Oh, he got my friend before I got him out. That's sad. Two on two, four people left in the melee. Okay, we got this. Let's just rush them. It's not worth waiting and it taking ages. Just stab them in the gut and go. Oh, I broke his shield. Holy crap. Whew. That was, uh, yeah. So am I fighting Sir Clifton now? Sir Clifton of the Glen. Fight me. No, I'll fight you fair. Where are you? You're over there. Come here. I'll even let you attack first. Okay? Ooh. He has skills. Ooh, now he doesn't. I think I split his head open. Uh... Oh, I got a gift. Oh, the 200 coins. Oh, yeah. You know, that's a really easy way to get some good renown and 4,000 coins. Like, that's not bad. Okay, I have an oil press here, apparently. 
I don't know how much money it makes, though. Why do I take three people with me now? Weird. Whoa, what is... Let's go over the accounts. How much do you wait, make? 300. That's not bad at all. Okay. Never mind. You're doing good, man. Um... Can I talk to the guild master? I thought there was a way you could like buy land. Um How is trade around here? Oh my goodness. Um wow, that was a uh, that was a lot. How does the wealth in this region compare? Here in King's Landing we are poorer than zero towns and richer than 35. Wow, in terms of local industry the most productive town in the world is known to be King's Landing. Here in King's Landing we produce less than zero wait, we produce less than zero towns and more than thirty-five. Wow. Uh, in terms of the output to surrounding villages, the town of Bravos is the richest in the known world. Yeah. In terms of trade main pool. Interesting. Um Political nature? What does it cause these wars? I guess I can't. Huh. Uh, what do you do? No, I guess I can't. I guess you can't buy land anymore. I guess that was like an older version, and I just, uh, saw that from, like, some notes someone took. I don't remember where it was. It was probably a probably on Reddit. Um. Oh, I have an oil press here. Uh, what is my oil press making? Are you being... Are you being efficient? Yeah, you are. 280. Good job. You're all good. Makes me kind of sad that... That there was already a place there, though, because, I mean, I want to start as many more as I can, and there's not a whole lot more options, really. Pro someone's gonna attack me. That's what's happening. Right? No? Wow! No one attacked me immediately. That's a pleasant surprise. Guildmaster Ralph. Uh, can I have an enterprise here, sir? A weavery. Uh, not really. Other weavery. Definitely not. The super expensive. Whoa, that's actually really good. Uh, I need 10,000 coins. Ironworks is not good. Oil is really good, actually. Uh, it's not as good as that, though. Okay, I need 10,000 coins, like, stat. How much do I have? 550, ugh. Am I gonna make it with, uh... When's my next paycheck? It should be in, like, one day. It should be in a day. Uh, maybe? It should be on the 8th. Right? Should be on the 8th. the hell? No one's gonna come attack me here, are they? Ooh, we got 4,000 in the bank. That's nice. How much am I gonna get here? 5,000. Perfect. Yo, Maiden Pool. Guildmaster. A. Hey, I want that good enterprise. I want that weavery and dye works, yo. 800 now. Oh. Oh, that's going to be so glorious. Okay, well, um I will probably just let time run for a month or two before next time. So, expect <laughs> for me to have a lot more money for the next episode. If you enjoyed, leave a like cuz it really helps out. Until next time, have a nice day and I'll see you later.